Welcome to another video. Who is Faza's mother? Well, she practically never left the palace, and it was as if fate itself was preparing her for an unusual mission. Hind had known Sheikh Mohammed since childhood because she was Mohammed's maternal cousin and paternal second cousin. The major event in her life occurred in 1979, when she turned 17. Hind and Mohammed's parents agreed on their union. Sheikh Mohammed was then the head of Dubai's police and defense minister. He was 30 years old and had already enjoyed the life of a bachelor. Two years before his engagement to Hind, the man even had a daughter, Manal, with a Lebanese woman, Randa. Apparently, Mohammed's family was tired of his love affairs and decided to show the world that the sheikh had settled down. For the avoidance of doubt, the wedding was organized on an unprecedented scale. The lavish celebration also had political overtones. The Emirates began to receive large revenues from the sale of oil and sought to show the whole world their advancement. Mohammed and Hind's wedding was the first major public event in Dubai. In scale, it was more like a national holiday than a wedding. The celebrations were held near the royal palace of Zabil. The huge sandy area in front of the palace was cleared and fenced. Lighting poles were installed and decorated. A 20,000-seat stadium was built especially for the wedding. The scale of the events is illustrated by the fact that only VIPs were allowed into the stadium. Hundreds of thousands of ordinary Arabs were accommodated in the open air. This was the only way they could see a ceremony unprecedented for the Emirates. A procession of twenty camels of a rare breed brought gifts to the feet of Hind. These were gifts to the bride from Mohammed and aristocratic guests. Hind al Makhthoum is the first lady of Dubai and mother of Crown Prince Sheikh Mohammed. She was born on February 12, 1962, and belongs to Dubai ruling Al Makhthoum dynasty. Her mother, Sheikha Sheikha, was the daughter of Dubai's ruler, Saeed II. The princess received a home upbringing in accordance with Islamic traditions. She practically never left the palace, and it was as if fate itself was preparing her for an unusual mission. So we talk about uh, her, uh, Hind al Makhthoum. Uh, a lot of the time we don't really see her. Actually, we have never seen her in public. No woman in the world has ever had such an expensive wedding until now when she got married. It was the most expensive marriage. Incredibly, the grandiose luxury did not face 17-year-old Hind after the celebration. She devoted herself fully to family life. Over the next two decades, she bore her husband 12 children. Sheikh Hamdan Faza has 11 other siblings. One of them we know, Rashid, he passed away, unfortunately. She gave birth almost every year, which is a feat in itself. Hind also raised several foster boys and girls she adopted from charity and she was very very careful and compassionate towards all of his uh, all of her and his children and when i say his means rashid al makhthum however the father of some of hens uh, non native children is muhammad the emir emirus sheikh uh, who, who took them from his uh, other wives and then gave them to his senior wife to raise. Basically means Hind al-Makhthoum was uh, really raising all of these kids, whether these are all uh, his, uh, Muhammad Bresh al-Makhthoum's biological kids or not. Uh, he gave it all of them to uh, his first wife. As eyewitnesses say, she not only did not object to this, but even rejoiced. So she loves kids. There is no doubt about that. For more videos, subscribe to our channel. Follow us on Facebook.